Alright, so what is going on guys and today we're back with another week in the life type of vlog So we are basically gonna just vlog the next few days But this Saturday especially the One Piece Pumas are coming out now you guys know me I'm not the craziest One Piece fan, but I am a streetwear slash anime fan like I love Streetwear anime collabs, sneaker anime collabs, whatever you want to call it. Like, I love that type of stuff when it's done in a not cringy way. Like, that is, like, my goal one day is to have a brand like that. Like, I always wanted to make a sneaker brand. Ever since I was literally, I've been doing this for years, trust me, before, the, like, the whole wave of, like, oh, like, now these companies are collabing with brand, like, with animes and making sneakers. So, we're going to be going to pick up the One Piece Pumas this Saturday. Again, like I said, I'm not the craziest One Piece fan, but um, I watched 800-something episodes of it. I pretty much watched most of One Piece for the most part um and then i just kind of fell off of it but i still you know i like certain aspects of one piece it's not my favorite anime of all time is i don't think it's top you know whatever people always gas it up but i am a naruto fan so i mean people are gonna come at me because i'm a naruto fan because i don't like one piece but like it's whatever it's not that i don't like one piece it's just it's whatever i don't gotta explain myself nonetheless we're gonna cop the one piece pumas because they're fire and i want that gear five luffy so we're gonna pick up those one piece pumas this saturday so we'll just vlog whatever else happens before that and obviously picking up that also reebok announced an even better collab and they announced a hunter hunter collab with reebok and they're making gone kilua um netero hisoka and then a hunter like a regular hunter association pair and i made a TikTok on it and then reebok hit me up so maybe we'll get those reebok Reebok Hunter Hunter collabs in, very excited about that, and still waiting for the rest of the Naruto um, Croc collabs to come out, so that was my little sneaker update for y'all. Hi right, y'all, we're in Kino right now, and there's a new initial D release of the manga, the Omnibus, and I found this little Yusuke figure of one that there was like a Ray version, there's a few versions of these, and I've been wanting to get this version of the figure, but every time I see it, it's for like way more than it's supposed to be, and they actually have it regularly placed, $12.99, everywhere I see it, it's like $20-$25, it's supposed to be $12.99. But here's the initial D Omnibus. So basically you buy the Omnibus if you're a member and you get $2 off or $3 off, whatever it is, plus this little Kino Kanuai little initial D card thing. So I think we're gonna do it because I've been wanting to start initial D. I just don't know if I wanna read it or watch it, but I feel like this is a cool like deal. And plus like the manga is really hard to get. So they're making an Omnibus. This is the setup they have for the initial D stuff. So. I mean, it's cool. So now we're back from the manga store, and as you guys saw, we did pick up Initial D Volume 1. Now, I'm pretty sure the Kino Kinoai Exclusive 1 is supposed to be a different cover than this, because uh, when I was at the register, the dude was like, oh, I don't think you get the thing with it, which is pretty much why I bought it, because I was like, oh, I'll buy it now, get the cheaper price, and get this, but... I guess this is the regular cover. I don't really care, to be honest. Um, I'm going to try to read Initial D to, for real. Like, I don't know if I'm going to read it or watch it. Somebody comment down below. I'm pretty sure people are going to say to read it, though. Um, so, Initial D, we did get the Volume 1, the Omnibus, and the little exclusive Kino card, which is tough. So, yeah, we're going to find somewhere to put these on the shelf. But the one I'm kind of really more excited about, which is crazy, is this Yusuke figure. Um, I don't have anything of Yusuke besides like a little mini thing. I don't have that much stuff from Yu Yu Hakusho. I only have like these three figures right here. I have a Kurama figure because I need I, every time I see something Kurama, I'll, pop, I'll pick it up. I've only seen that statue. I've never seen anything else unless it was like a crazy expensive statue. But if I saw a Kurama of this, I'm confident. Like I need more Kurama stuff. So we bought all those little Yu Yu Hakusho mini blind bags to try to get um, Kurama. We didn't get him. Um, but we have this Yusuke right here. So here's the Yusuke figure. These ones are just so cool, like the art style of it and the way the figure looks. Like if I ever see more of these in characters that I actually like, I'm gonna pick them up. Cause 12 bucks, I like this better than a Funko Pop. All right, vlog, it is the next day and we have a very exciting unboxing because this company hit me up and I'm doing a sponsored deal with them. So not for YouTube or anything, actually for TikTok, because your boy's been going crazy on TikTok. But um, we do have this sponsorship from this company. It's actually kind of two companies. Um, and basically I need to post a get ready with me like make an outfit with these and then post some Instagram So I guess it's Instagram and TikTok and post some Instagram photos in these um, it is a pair of shoes not the Reebok ones again Reebok did hit me up. Hopefully they do send over the hunter hunter collab This is not for YouTube, but I'm still gonna open it on YouTube because uh, obviously I show you guys everything So basically they hit me up. It's JD sports JD sports hit me up Like if you guys know what JD sports is like a foot locker a foot action a finish line a, that, that thing actually finish line and JD sports are owned by the same thing whatever um, So JD sports hit me up 
and basically part of a pair of shoes that's releasing over there um i just gotta do a campaign for so the pair of shoes is from a brand i actually have never owned a pair of shoes from before and some of you guys are probably gonna be like what are those but then some of you guys are actually gonna know what these are and it's more so on the running side of things but this brand is also trying to move more towards lifestyle, if that makes sense. Um, this shoe right here, though, is not really lifestyle shoe. Like, I've seen the shoe before. I already know what shoe they're sending me. Um, but I've actually wanted this brand shoe for a while. Like, you guys know, I work at Lululemon. Um, and I have Lululemon shoes. I love, um, what's the other ones? I love Solomon's. Like, I love running slash hiking style shoes and i've always wanted to try a pair of shoes from this brand like i was planning on buying one eventually anyway if i saw them for a good price but the fact that i actually got sent a pair of these it is on cloud if you guys know what on cloud is it looks like this you've probably seen them probably seen them at the gym probably seen them people running in them and yeah i've never owned a pair of on cloud so without further ado let's open this up and they did send over i believe it's just the yeah, it's a black pair of them. So they're these all black. Oh, that's tough. These are like good, like literally every day, just like I'm gonna wear these, like for real. Like, again, it's not sponsored for YouTube. I can say whatever I want on YouTube. It's literally just an all black, comfy running shoe. Like, I'm gonna wear these for like normal day to day stuff and probably, probably even to work. Like, I know Lululemon has shoes now, but I'll probably wear these there as well. But this is the On Clouds in this all black color. And I've always wanted to try this sole. Like, this is really what like On Cloud is known for. Like, like why is there holes in the sole i don't know but i'm here for it so i do love that about them and yeah like i said we're gonna do a get ready with me for them on tiktok so make sure you guys go check out the tiktok go show love to that tiktok specifically but um yeah hopefully you know i do everything that they want me to do for the gear that they for the video that they want me to do so i'm very excited feels good to have a sponsorship um like a sneaker sponsorship i feel like i haven't had one in a while um so kind of cool to get another pair of shoes in from a company that's actually like a pretty big company too hi vlog we're outside right now because Yo. i'm taking pictures in the on clouds which we have to do cloud for monster <laughs> <laughs> they're called the cloud monsters but we're taking some photos here at brian park trying to get some for the instagram <laughs> but i just sat on one of the tables and busted i didn't even sit, sit, I, didn't even like sit. Like I like leaned, leaned and said and the whole <laughs> table just broke on me. But we're gonna take some photos over here, see if we can do some standing ones, because we just did a bunch of sitting ones over here. Alright y'all, so on the way home, I stopped at Kino, and I actually found this weekly jump magazine, and it has all, like Jujutsu Kaisen on the cover, so we're gonna pick it up, it's only five and Okay, all brand endorsement stuff aside, why are these actually like the most comfortable shoes I've ever worn? Like I actually feel like I'm walking on clouds. Like it's actually crazy. I never actually felt a shoe that, that was this like comfortable. So, I mean, shout out to OnCloud, bro. Anyways, let's go on into book off. This Naruto from AliExpress is kind of fire. I'm not gonna lie. I've seen these mysteries before where it comes with like a uh, Hunter Hunter figure and then like a bunch of little accessories of them. Bro, this is so cool. It's only $5. I think we gotta pick it up. I vlog, so we're back at the crib now, and I just put all the stuff away because I was making a TikTok, of course. But here is the little Hunter Hunter thing I got. It came with Gone, a shoe, and a bag, which is so tough. Like, that is so cool. I love little cool things like that. So I was very excited to find that because I actually knew what that was, and I was just... I wanted to get that at one point and I just didn't buy it because it was like $15, but I got it for five. And then we put the Jujutsu Kaisen um, Shonen Jump magazine back there in the Jujutsu Kaisen shelf. And now I'm going to edit the on cloud um, sponsorship stuff, send it in and hopefully it gets approved and the deal goes through. All right, vlog. So it is the next day and I got a text from Reebok this morning saying a package should be delivered today. And long behold, I was expecting like a little sneaker box. No, we got this huge box. So I don't know what's in here. I don't know if it's one pair of shoes, two pairs of shoes, if it's just like the big like PR type of box. Like I don't know what it is, but it's obviously from the Hunter Hunter collection. So I'm very excited to open this. Shout out to Reebok for sending this stuff over. Literally in this video, we got the on cloud sent us something. We got Reebok, like it's a W vlog. So we're gonna open this up. I gotta make a TikTok at the same time. So let's set that up. Without further ado, Let's open this big box up because I was not expecting a big package. Um, I see. Okay, okay, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I see, I see two boxes. We have two boxes in here, chat. We have two boxes. We have one regular Reebok box, 
and then we have one we have one like special hunter hunter box so i don't know what we should open first i don't want to look at the size i don't want to look at the tags because they're going to show what shoe they are so which one should we open first the reebok the reebok leave All the right. hunter for last we'll leave no the hunter look. for last this is a regular reebok box we're gonna open this up three two one oh. let's see which one it is I see a color. I see the goon. We got the goon ones. Yo, let's go. All right, so the actual model on these ones is the LX 2200s. And this is the goon pair. So I'm very excited about the goon pair. Look at the insole with the Hunter Hunter on it, the materials. Honestly, this one was probably my favorite from the whole entire collection. Um, we're going to see which pair that one is, though. But... From pictures, this was my favorite, and in person, color-wise and everything, these look amazing. And look at the Hunter Hunter logo, look at the suede and everything. All right, let's get into the second box. We're gonna, we gotta do it. All right, these ones, let's see what these are. This is a different box, this is a Hunter Hunter box. So let's see which ones we get in these. Three, two, one, let's go. We got the Kilo. <laughs> Bro, that was the, that was the perfect pairing. That was the perfect pairing. That was the only right option to send together. Shout out to Reebok for sending these over. Um, well, oh, I didn't even know it came with an extra blue lace. That's cool. That looks like it's like lightning form and stuff. So, this one is tough as well. Honestly, I don't know which one I like better. Like this, this fits Kilo was so good. Look at the bottom. His skateboard design. His skateboard design is on the bottom, and the actual shoe gives skater vibes like it's more of a skate shoe. This fits him good, and this honestly fits going as well. You got his same pattern that's on his little cuffs and his backpack strap. Yo, W collab. Uh, we'll definitely do some outfits inspired of these in the next video. So thank you Reebok for sending these over. Hunter Hunter collection out now. Five pairs in total. This is the Kiloa and the Gone pair. One, I was not expecting two of them. When they texted me, they were like, oh, tell us the three that you're most interested in and we'll like see if we have those sizes or whatever. Like whichever we have like a size in. Show them, bro. That's what I'm telling them. So I'm like, Sorry. so I was like, oh, like I wasn't expecting like two pairs of shoes. I was expecting whichever pair they had by size in. So the fact that they sent over both, both, because I couldn't decide honestly between these two, I really couldn't decide. Um, Cause like one, I do like Kilo is my favorite character, but the Gon ones just look amazing. But like these look amazing too. So Kilo ones look like his shoes with that round dot in the front. You yeah, know, that was the point. I that know. was yeah. It looks like Kilo is mm -hmm. actual shoe, which mm -hmm. is that like the details on these is insane. Crazy. Look at the bottoms. Look at the bottoms. <laughs> so yeah, I'm very excited. I chose. So it is the next day, and it's pouring rain. Flood watch. I'm in a freaking rain jacket. I'm over here getting drenched. But it is the One Piece Puma drop and I told y'all I'd go get them so we gotta go get them because I don't want to miss them out and then they sell out because the Reebok sold out so shout out to Reebok for sending those over. Uh, I posted the TikToks and stuff on them but we're walking to the Puma store so hopefully they have them. I'm going right when they open. It's like 940 something right now. They open at 10 so let's get there and get out of this pouring rain. Y'all, there's a line wrapped around the Puma store. Hopefully we can secure a pair of the Gear 5 Luffy. The line is literally all in the store. So, yeah, don't know if we're gonna be able to get them. I've been on this line for 30 plus minutes and it's looking like they're already running out of sizes. All right, y'all, I'm not gonna lie. Puma just let me down heavy. All the resellers were at the front of the line. They pretty much bought up all the pairs. They let them take, I literally saw a dude with like four boxes. Um, they, apparently they didn't even get the Shanks ones in. All they had was the Luffy and I think the Buggy ones and they didn't even get the black beard. I didn't see anybody with the black beard. So that means that they were literally taking all of the, the Luffy ones. Like everybody in the front of the line literally just bought them. People were buying ones that weren't even their size because the Puma employees just started being like, oh, all we have left is this size, this size, this size. And everybody in front of me was like, oh, screw it. We'll just take that size. So yeah, I forgot how much I hate sneaker drops. Like I haven't been to a sneaker drop in so long. I used to be on the lines in the malls and deal with this stuff all the time. I used to deal with this stuff at D1 all the time when I was the employee dealing with them. But that was just a screwed up drop. I'm not gonna lie. So yeah, what a waste of time. But you know, Reebok, Hunter Hunter collab was way better anyway. So shout out to Reebok. But that's pretty much it for the vlog, y'all. Sorry I couldn't get the One Piece Pumas. I tried. It is what it is. Maybe one day. I don't know. We'll see. 
stay tuned maybe in a future vlog but unless puma's sending them to me i'm probably not gonna pick them up baby you will survive hop inside a ride i know you want to slide know you want to slide with me because i'm vibing baby girl i'm vibing don't show up to the party with no violence don't show up to the party with no violence i take you out i break you out i got you smiling